In this lesson, I want to show you how to activate the front end editing of uh, your site. Uh, when you look at the home page now, there's nothing here. You can't really edit it because you have to activate it. And the way that you do so, you go to menus. You first, you must first log in to your site in order for you to do that. So since this is a fresh install, I'm going to have to create uh, something here to log in. But if you already have this, your site, and you wanted to edit the front end, just make sure that you have a section where you can log in. So I'm just simply just going to change this here to the users, and I'm going to create a simple login form so that once I log in, then it gives me access. So I've changed that. Uh, and now let me go over to Page Builder. Since I don't have any page, I'm just going to create uh, a page here and call it Joomla Module. And I'm just going to add some demo stuff for now. So I have a new page that I just added, and I'm going to refresh the home page, see what we've got. So now I'm able to log in to the front end of the site. And once I log in, you still can't see anything at this point yet. Uh, we're going to get to this. So to see something here, let's go back here. We're going to create another menu. Right now, the home, the reason why you can't see anything yet, because the home page is the menu that you log into. So we're just going to create another one. We're going to call this one Joomla. And let's connect this. Go to page builder and we're going to connect this new menu to the new pages we created. So you click on select and then Joomla module and then save and close. So now let's refresh the home page. We have another uh, menu here called Joomla. So let's click on this. And once you click on that, you automatically notice that you have an edit page icon over here. So when you click on edit, you're going to activate the editing for this and you know if you don't see anything yet it's okay just look at the very bottom of the screen you have to add new row you have the tools when you click on it you can page options export import page templates so you can change the templates uh, on the front end here as well so let's go over to the section you want to make sure that you, you save your work you know there's so many times that I've been working on something and I realized that you know I didn't save it and uh, you want to make sure that you save your work, whatever changes that you're doing. So once you put your mouse over anything on the page, you notice that you activate the edit icon here. You see uh, this here. So you can click to edit. And the same thing you see on the back end, you see also on the front end. So that's how you're able to activate the editing on the front end of the site. So now... Once you've done that, you click on the menu again and you're able to see the changes that you've made. Also, the changes happen, you know, in real time. So once you make a change and you click save, it automatically shows up here. Okay, let's move on to the next lesson.